Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, hi, hello. I'm Lolly Stardust and I post videos about my David Bowie collection. And today I'm going to show you two Bowie box sets, Spine Through a Keyhole and Clairville Grove demos. Now I know that these are not the latest David Bowie releases, they're kind of old by now because they were both released in 2019, but the thing is that um, I just got them. <laughs> and I even thought I would do an unboxing video to show you guys everything from beginning to end, but uh, I was basically too eager to open them and I couldn't wait until the next day, so uh, that wasn't really working for me. But today I'll show you everything that's inside. And first one up is going to be Spine Through a Keyhole. So this one was the first of a few David Bowie releases that were planned to coincide with uh, Space Oddity's 50th anniversary back in 2019 and I always thought that this was a really nice box set to have. I don't even know why it took me so long to actually order it, uh, but I'm glad that I finally did. So this one really includes demos and unreleased songs and things that we hadn't heard before, so I thought it was really nice to, to have it. So when the lid comes off, it comes off like this. Um, and the first thing that you are going to find is this book booklet that um, includes information about each and every track, everything that you need to know about the recording and uh, what it's all about, and it even includes some of the lyrics or parts of the lyrics. I thought it was really, really nice because this is full of brand new information. And then the second thing that you would see is this uh, <laughs> Bowie picture. It's a photo taken by photographer Ray Stevenson. There you go. A really nice touch, I would say. And then the first vinyl single that's in here is Mother Grey and Heat of the Morning. Now, Mother Grey, I would say that is the main highlight or one of the main highlights of this box set because it's really um, a previously unreleased track that we hadn't heard before. Even people who had been collecting Bowie for a really long time, like myself, this um, is like a treasure inside this box, Mother Grey and In the Heat of the Morning. Uh, In the Heat of the Morning is a song that we, we know already, but again, this is a different version. Um, all of these tracks are uh, very unfinished and uh, they're in demo version, they're in mono, and it's something that I thought it was actually very, very nice that they add here a disclaimer, which I'll talk about later on. And then the second vinyl single that's in here, it's uh, Goodbye 3D Joe and Love All Around. Again, tracks that are brand new to the public that we hadn't heard before. And it's part of uh, the Spaces Oddity album um, history or story, if you will. And then here we have Angel Angel Grubby Face, first version, so it says here one. And I think it's actually very nice that they added David Bowie's handwriting to the labels as part of the design. I think that's a, it's a really nice touch. And then the other side includes London, London by Tata, which is a song that we know, but again, this is a, a different version in this box. And then the last one, the fourth, vinyl record that, it, that it's in here is, uh, includes Angel Angel Grubby Face, second version, and Space Oddity. And yeah, that's the last vinyl record in here, so the box is now empty, but I wanted to say that I thought it was really nice that they included a disclaimer um, right here. So if you're looking for perfect sound quality or a great sound quality, this is not it, but I think it's really, really nice that you can read the disclaimer before you actually buy it. So it says here, these recordings have been mastered from the only available sources to provide the best sound quality possible. However, dropouts, tape shedding, degradation, and distortion are inherent in the sources, but we hope the historical importance of these recordings outweighs any search imperfections and does not detract from your enjoyment of the performances. And I totally agree with them when they say that it doesn't really 
it doesn't really matter that it's not perfect because this is part of it's part of David Bowie's history. It's part of uh, the album's uh, story and creation. And if you're interested in that, I think it's a really nice item to have. And moving on to the second box set that is right here, Clairville Grove. Um, I think it's really nice that they that although the boxing is white, it's not a perfect white, which is good because as we know, uh, white sleeves or white box sets, for example, the station to station box set comes to mind, we know that white does not age well. So I think it's nice that they included a few spots, like um, it's already dirty, so if it gets yellowish, uh, with time, it doesn't really matter because it doesn't look perfect from the start. And so again, the lid comes off like the other one, and then the first thing you see again is the booklet, which includes information about the recordings that David Bowie did with John Hutch, Hutchinson, and it includes, again, parts of lyrics and the story behind each and every song. And then after you remove the booklet, you would see this. And again, here we have a very nice picture of David Bowie playing the guitar with John Hutch. And then, first single that we have here is Space Oddity, a very early version. So that's uh, side one. And side two is the song Lover to the Dawn. If you don't know that song, you should. It's really nice. It's like the um, the song that originated Signet Committee, the song that we know from Space Oddity. So uh, it's really, really nice to have. These songs, some of the songs here, had already appeared on bootlegs, if you collect bootlegs and if you're interested. It's something that you would have already listened to, but it's nice that now it's an official release and some of them are different versions uh, from what we already knew. For example, the next one here, Chingley, right? So this is a song that has appeared on several different bootlegs, but this version is different, and Debbie Bowie sings in this version, which is not uh, not very common that you can find it out there. And then here, An Occasional Dream. I think this version had already appeared, I think, in the, um, in the Sound and Vision box set that came uh, came out in the 90s, I think, but either way, it's a really nice uh, record to have. And then the last one, this one only includes three vinyl records, the last one is Let Me Sleep Beside You, we know that one, and Life is a Circus. Uh, these two tracks had already appeared on both clicks again, but these ver versions are kind of different and now they are official. So again, I think they, they have the same disclaimer right here. It says that the recordings have been mastered from the only available sources and so on and so forth. Um, and so that means the sound quality is not perfect, but if you really appreciate um, getting to know how things are made, how uh, the creation of the Space Oddity album came about, I think it's really, really nice to have. It's a very important release. And there are more that were released in 2019. I haven't got them yet, but I'm thinking that I maybe should. Um, these things were gathered and released later on on the Conversation Piece um, release. It's a CD uh, version, but uh, it's probably nice to have. I haven't uh, gotten that one yet, but it's it's in my plans. So this is it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like David Bowie or if you like record collecting in general, please make sure to subscribe to this channel and also make sure to follow me on Instagram. I post everything about my David Bowie collection there and I hope to see you guys again really, really soon. Bye bye.